hello once again welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to introduce you to another ai tool that you can use instead of mentioning so this ai tool is called instant art and i'm going to show you how to generate an amazing artwork using this so i'm going to show you how to use this amazing ai to generate your own artwork just like what we have over here now i've already done some over here so if you create an account over here you can easily go ahead and then generate and if you generate anything you generate will be saved or will be under my images i generated this and then this was the keyword i use african woman with short messy black hair golden eyes and all that so i'm going to copy this keywords and then just modify it and i'll show you how to generate now if you come to the home page this has been the work done by some other users of this platform and if you want to look at the keywords they use you can easily click on that and then you can see the keywords they use to generate that now we are also going to do our own just after creating an account but like subscribe and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials so now that we know how to go about this after creating an account what you have to do is to go to generate now we need to put in our description image the keywords you want to use now i want to create something african woman with short hair but this time around let me say long i just want to modify my old keyword long messy hair golden eye or let me can even go ahead and say maybe red eyes a square jaw and all those things i can even say maybe 20 so it should be far younger 20 old wearing street wear clothes and all that if you don't want to include certain things within your ai or your artwork your final artwork then you can actually type those things over here and then it's as if you are subtracting something from your final artwork okay so now if you come to this session we have the dimension you can actually select the dimension for the image you want to use i'm actually going to stick to the landscape the 768 by 512 i'm going to stick to that and then we have the model and on the model i'm going to just select majority version 4 i want to get something very unique and then the guidance scale and i'm going to leave it at seven there's a more contrast i just want to leave it at seven i'm okay with that and then the image counts if you have more image count the it's going to affect the rendering time so it's going to take longer time to actually process your image so i'm going to stick to two for now so i'm just going to go ahead and click on generate and it's going to take some time to actually generate this and it's going to generate two for me so let's give ourselves some time to generate that but before that like subscribe and also don't forget to turn on post notifications so you can use this ai tool instead of my journey and it's very very amazing i'll be, in be introducing you to more free ai tool that you can use to create an amazing artwork so let's wait for this to process so our file is almost done our file is almost done and we just have to give ourselves some time so now i can just open this file and now these are the keywords i use african woman with long messy black hair so as you can see if you look critically on this this hair is quite messy and it has given us something we are saying what red eye is not exactly red eye but we are getting something very unique generated by the ai so you can easily use your own keywords you can see we have the pink neon lighting right beneath this so you can easily combine everything and then you can actually generate something using this amazing ai tool so i have another sample i actually generated two so this is the second one and if you compare this you can see the keywords we have over here contains exactly the image we have at the moment like subscribe for more tips and more techniques subscribe for more so if you want to use any of this the keywords over here you can easily click and then copy them and then use them to generate your own ai you just have to modify them and then you can create something very very unique till i come away again always like subscribe for more bye